Hello, Diecast fans, and welcome to another brand new episode of Jim's Magnificent Miniature Motor Cars. And for this episode, we will be unboxing this lovely piece from Matchbox, a moving parts model, wrapped in their brand new eco-friendly plastic-free wrapping or packaging. Okay, this is a BMW CSL 3.0. And well, they've made quite a big deal out of the fact that none of this is made of plastic. And in fact, the car itself is supposedly made from recycled metal. So it's a rather nice piece. Not a huge fan of the fact that there's no B pillar. Nor for that matter am I a huge fan of this uh, bonnet that apparently doesn't open all the way or needs. Wow. Okay, folks. Part of the allure of this car is supposed to be that it has an opening hood. But apparently, there is a real process involved in opening the hood. We're not even talking about a... Ooh. Look at that. I can see the inline six from here, and it looks really nice. But there's something up with the mechanism to open it with, and I don't want to freaking snap this thing in two or anything. So, yeah, Matchbox. The fact that you make it so complicated to get to this freaking motor is in and of itself a problem. Before I start to lose it here, let's have a look at what the real uh, BMW, the 1973 BMW CSL 3.0 looks like. Okay. So yeah, it's a good, not great replication. And this, <laughs> This hood, bonnet, for those of you who speak the King's English, is not doing this car any freaking favors. So yeah, maybe at some point I'll figure out how to get it all the way open. But now, oh wow. The fact that I have to figure out how to get it all the way open means this car, which by the way cost uh, $7, give or take. Yeah, this car gets a 6 out of 10, which is a shame. Oh yeah, because also because it should have a B-pillar. So yeah, this car, it, it's actually pretty nice under normal circumstances. Given the price, it'd probably be worth an 8 or maybe even a 9. I mean, look at it. It's not bad looking by any stretch. But because, yeah, because opening the hood is a real pain this only gets a six and that's it for this unboxing folks sorry i couldn't have given this car a higher score but anyway if you like what you see please do consider giving me a like and a subscribe and hitting that notification bell